A typical home being weatherized by the Macomb County Community Services Agency was used to demonstrate the work completed to state and local leaders and the press. The home used in the demonstration required a wide range of weatherization measures. A majority of the work had been completed in advance. Into or out of the building to create a pressure difference between the inside and the outside of the building shell. These uh, air leaks are exaggerated by uh, air leaks rush, uh, coming in through the, are easy to find just by feeling with your hand. Uh, and at this time, I'm going to turn the fan on and hopefully we'll be able to uh, show you where some of them leaks are coming in. sites that we have uh, found in, in houses around here, ceiling light fixtures and uh, uh, plumbing, any, any place where there's a hole or a crack, the air will come in and that helps us locate it very easily so we can take care of the problem. Uh, there are two in, uh, tests done to a home, a pre-test and a post. Uh, the pre-test is where we gather all the information on the house. And, uh, and to measure how leaky the home is. And the, and the post test is to uh, find out where, where we're at, how much savings, uh, how, how far did we bring the house down as far as air changes per hour. Uh, at this home, at the pre was 20 air changes per hour. That means for every hour, the air was changed 20 times. And our goal is to try to cut that into probably around 10. We don't want to get the house too tight because we, the house is just like you and I. We have to breathe uh, air, and so does the house. If we get it too tight, then there's stagnant air in the house. So that, that's our goal is try to get it down to approximately 10 air changes an hour. Uh, infrared camera set up here, and we use that in the weatherization program also, and it is to help us find uh, uh, cavities that are not well insulated and hit on the monitor you can see where these these dark areas are there's a few areas that's where the insulation is missing in the cavity so if there's any questions I'll be free feel free to ask